Hey YouTube gang, welcome back. Today we are installing the wide body kit on the back and we're installing these rib nets. And I broke my rib net tool right off the bat. So I was practicing on this piece of sheet metal over here and I put it in and I gave it a squeeze and I squeezed it too much and Broke the tip right off of it. Can you see that? Yeah. So, I improvised. Since I have no more quarter inch rib nut adapter pieces because it's broken, I found a quarter inch bolt that I'm going to be using to install the kit. And I found a quarter inch nut now let me show you guys how to do this without a rib nut gun. First off, we want to take a quarter inch drill bit. Actually, this is one size bigger, whatever that is, five inches, whatever. And you want to widen your hole. And you want to take your quarter inch rib nut. And it should fit very tight. And just Lightly. You will need two wrenches of the exact same size, whatever size fits your bolt and your nut. Just take a nut, put it on here, screw it into your rib nut, make sure it goes all the way through to the other side of your rib nut, tighten it down. Put your box end on this side, open in here, while holding your box end steady, tighten the bolt, the nut. Keep the bolt held steady, tighten the nut. What this will do, it'll cause the bolt to try to pull through which will essentially flare the rib nut just like the tool does. It actually works quite well. And give it nine, 10 twists, whatever. Don't do too much or you'll end up breaking it as well. Um, when all said and done, you should be able to unscrew it and your rib nut should be in place with no issues. Uh, you can see we got a long ways to go here. We're way out here, so we got to do some trimming on the inside of the fenders as well. I'm going to finish up getting these rib nuts mounted, and then I'll get back with you guys here in just a minute. 